So today we're going to talk about the Maclay's Spectre. It's an Australian prickly stick insect. So they come from Australia. And if you can see, he looks kind of like a dead leaf. And that's their adaptation is that they have developed flatter limbs to blend in with their leaves that they live in. So this guy lives on mainly eucalyptus trees. He eats primarily eucalyptus leaves. And part of their defense is the shaking you can see. He's trying to blend in with leaves in the wind, so he thinks that he is hiding quite well right now. And the other one is, you can see that the tail is curled up kind of like a scorpion stinger. That's their other defenses. They're trying to say, I'm big and scary, please don't bother me, I can hurt you. But in reality, they are completely harmless. So this guy just requires some um, dirt for substrate and moss, and then um, trees and sticks, like leaves to climb on. So we feed him um, silver dollar eucalyptus and uh, some guava, and in the summer, raspberry and oak leaves. Yeah, they've been laying eggs. We haven't had any hatch yet, but uh, the habitat seems to be proper for them because they've been laying eggs for us. We don't, I have said he, but we only have females. So they're breeding before they come to us, which is kind of cool. So this one is a female. In the wild, she'll grow up to be about that size. In captivity, probably not. But we know it's a female because she is spiky. You can see all the little spikes. The males are much smaller and smoother and they have large wings because they fly to get to her for mating. And she also has this, which is called an ovipositor and that's where she lays her eggs from. The females are a lot larger than the male. The male will ride on the female. So that's it for the McClay's Spectre. Tune in next time and we'll go over another insect.